Hello and welcome to my channel. It's me, Tina. Today I am here with my first Dollarama haul. And if I have enough time, I'll do my uh, Dollar Tree haul. They're both not very big. Um, I just went in there quickly and um, got what I wanted and out. So I will start off with the food which there's not much here but um i just have one of these um uh lemon cakes and it comes in a we've had this before it comes in a late little cake pan and it's a uh, lemon cake and it's really really good but what i plan on doing it is add a add icing and then um Put these um, sticks into them and dip them in chocolate like uh, cake pops. So I bought a couple of those. This will probably be lots for that. But Billy, his favorite, favorite is cake pops. He loves that. And that's, I think, all the food that I have here for now. So then I will go into this. And this is a... Um, cosmetic uh, brush holder but I'm gonna use it for my um, like when I wash my brushes just to stick them in there to to dry them um, yeah so I'm not sure if I'll use them for my cosmetics probably not for my cosmetics just for the um, for the brushes I use for painting and stuff so and that was this one was $4, and it's a sturdy thing. I've been holding off getting one of these. I didn't want to get one, but then I started doing more painting stuff, and I'm like, yes, I need that. And these are $1.25, and one's on the floor. And this cake, uh, $2.50. And well, you can't even probably you can't even uh, make a cake for two fifty because the eggs and oh, I bet you, you can't even. And then um, I got these shavers. Um, wanted to try them for Billy because he's got rough, coarse hair, so I wanted to try that for his hair. And another thing I got was um, I want to start early planting and I know it's way too early yet but um this has um it says it's a greenhouse starter kit it has how many pieces I don't even know no idea but it has all kinds of trays and tags and stuff so I just wanted to have it ready um because last year I did kind of in pots cucumbers tomatoes and we really really liked it so um this year i want to do a little bit more and uh when you see my dollar tree haul you'll see i got a bunch of seeds so yeah um and that was i believe that was four dollars um then dollar rama had these stamps um this is the one like the travel one it's got the suitcase the camera the hot air balloon and the boat and all kinds of stuff and then it comes with uh, the little stamping block I don't think it's much of a block but anyway it comes with that and for a dollar 25 I figured just to you know um, slip into happy mail or something like that and this one's really pretty uh, it has the flowers and they did have all kinds of other ones but I just picked up these ones because I just I don't know, I just figured they're kind of tiny, and I like more of the bigger substantial stamps. Um, then I just got a couple of bags of self-sealing bags, and there's 24 in here, and I really like those. Then I got some glue, because I was out of this, and I really, really like this glue. Um, I like this better than the Uhu Yahoo Uhu glue or whatever it's called. Um, yeah, I, I really like this when I have a like a large item 
to glue down like a piece of paper. Then I saw these, um, okay, what does this say? These are uh, fine tip acrylic metallic paint marker. So this is the silver and this one is the gold and they were $1.25 each. And this is a paint marker. This is a white. Um, I wanted to try this one. So this is a paint marker. I don't know what the dif difference would be, but maybe the tips are different. And then I saw this there. And um, this set has was $4. It has 10 brushes. It's got 15 pieces, five spatulas. It says artist brush and spatula. And it's got this little um, carrying case, I think. And yeah, I love it when it comes with its own carrying case. And it's got like tons of brushes. Well, it says 10 brushes. And it's, they've got the, I think, the long handles, which I really like. And I cannot open this. Yeah, so it's got the long handles. And then it's got the metal spatulas, which, yeah, they're really good. And this thing to put them, like this case, is really good just to put it all away. So... For $4, that's pretty good. I did not need brushes, but when I saw that, I'm like, that is a good deal. And then I saw, I think I saw Tina Kazarian haul that, and that was why I wanted it. So it's your fault, Tina. <laughs> and then I saw Tina hauling these, and I'm like, oh, I love these. I've never had any kind of little um, tiles. Like these are, they call them plastic word beads. But to me, they look like little tiles. And, uh, yeah, I thought they were really cute. So they have all kinds of words. And they were $2 a box. So I got two of them. And then I got on the band ba wagon with these uh, paper pads. Now, these paper pads are very thin. These papers are very, very thin. They're not very high quality, but I really like them for, they're $4 each, and I'll show you what I do with them. When I do an altered book, and I've started it with this, with this book, um, I glue them in here, the pages. The pages, I glue them in here, and... You can, like, this is, on this side is one page, and on this side is one page, plus the book page, and you can tell it's, it's still, you know, not very thick. So, that's what I like to do with them when, when I alter books, that's when I use them, and I'm, you know, I used one of each of these pages, and it was the blue, so I love the blue. And that one was called Daisy, and this one is called Genevieve, Genevieve, or something like that. And there's 50 sheets in here, so there's 25 different colors, or different papers in here. And I really love this one, because it's, you know, the vintage. I really love that. And then, this is called Delilah, and... I just really like these colors too. I'll just quickly breeze through them. Yeah, very, very thin papers, but $4 for 50 sheets. I figure that's not too bad. I wasn't going to get them at first, but then I'm like, oh, but it's paper. I have to get it. Then um, I caved and I got this glass mat. Um, it is, I believe it is like a 13 inch area, cutting area. So, yeah, it's craft tools. 
So, and it tells you all kinds of measurements on here. I'm not sure exactly what it all is, but $4. And I'm always forever needing cutting mats. So, yeah, right on my desk right now I have two of them. With this one I have three. And then I usually, like, if I dirty one, I take it off. And I dirty the next one, I take it off. And then I wind up going to clean them all because, yeah, then I, then I need to clean them all. And then I saw it was Crafty Kitty who convinced me to get these because, um... At first, I was like, oh, I don't need tags. I'll make my own. But then she started showing them, and I'm like, oh, my gosh. i got to have them. got to have them. And they are the Artsy. Uh, I think they are usually in Michaels. And there's 16 pieces in here. There's, like, some ribbon and string in here and nice tags. So, Yeah. And I really like this one. I really, really like this one. This one even has like vintage ribbon in there. And this one with the little metal ring and the tags back there. So I really like those. And I found, uh, there was six that I found. Uh, one of each. That was what I found. So I don't know if my Dollar Rama is just putting them out one by one or what they're being stingy with them maybe they didn't want me to get them all <laughs> maybe I love it that you know they have this doily in there and I know Krista Crafty Kitty she had one with all doilies I would have loved to get that one but no such luck already here I go with my Dollar Tree haul and I will start with the, let me see, I'll start with these. Look at these. They're like the teal color and this is like so soft. These are candles and they smell, they smell so nice. Oh, and I just, I just love them. And I had to get them. So I got two of those and they're just so soft. And once I'm done burning them, I'll probably wind up taking that off. <laughs> it's so cute. I don't know where to put the stuff here. And then um, they had these vegetable thins. And I got quite a few of these boxes. Because for $1.25, really, really a bargain. Because I pay a lot more at a grocery store for these. And I like to eat these with um, cottage cheese or salsa. They are so delicious. Then I got this burrito seasoning. They have the taco there. I still had some of the taco. So I kept those. Or didn't get those. And then I got. They had these little buckets. And um, all you do is. I think you just add water. And the. Dirt is in there and everything. And this is the strawberry kit. They only had one strawberry. They had two of the tomato. So I got two of the tomato. And these are... It doesn't say what kind of tomato. It just says grow kit. So, yeah. We'll see what we do with our little garden. And then I found... Um, some of these socks and they're not the Christmas ones or the, you know, the, they don't have the tree or the hearts or anything. They just have the, the trucks on there, the green and, or it's kind of like a gray and then it has the green, um, heel and the top there. So I got a few of those. And then I got some uh, seeds. I got some cherry tomatoes. Uh, lettuce. And I got carrots. 
radishes. And this is the dark uh, green Italian parsley. I got some cantaloupe. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to grow these in pots. Probably my husband will have to, you know, dig something. And then I also got watermelon. So we do have a garden plot, but there's so many rabbits here that we get nothing. We get nothing if we plant it there. And then here's some uh, chili peppers. And here is, it says uh, Market More 76 cucumbers. And then I got these cucumbers. And then this says coriander. But I know, I think coriander is supposed to be, is it cilantro? I believe it is. And so I got two of those. I love cilantro. So I'll be making like my little salsas with this. And let me just throw this in here. So I can clean that up. And then I got some stuff to make a fairy garden. Now most of you know that I love horses. And they had these there. Now, I don't know if I'm going to keep them this color, but I'm going to do something with these. So I got a brown one, and isn't she cute? And they come with their own little combs, but I won't be using the combs. This is a gray one. And Billy, he loves the movie um, Stallion, or Spirit. And Spirit of the Cimarron, he loves that, that movie. He watches it all the time. So me and him will, he and I will make something uh, like a fairy garden or something. And then here is a black one. <gasps> I just love it. I want a black horse one day. And then, uh, along with the fairy garden items, last time I didn't find the teapot. So I found the little tea, tea, I can't say it, teapot, and I found the little gnomes, there's three of them in there, and I found one of these little girls, I'm not sure if I found these last time, but they're so cute, and then this is more my style, like the, uh, the uh, cactus house, and I think this is really cute. The tree stump, and it is so detailed, like, yeah, it is so cute. And this one, where the little gnomes have all their shovels and everything stacked up against there. And then here is the little shoe house I like that one and here's some more of the little tiny fairies are they fairies yes they are the little fairies and then I got this four-wheeler and we have a four-wheeler that is red like this and my boy he loves when his dad gives him a ride on it oh my goodness and this is one of those water uh, wheels, water feature. And then look at this one. I love this. This apple. Mmm, it, it makes me want to take a bite of it. So pretty. I love that. And then there's this one. It looks to me like it's a, a tulip, you know, an upside down tulip like this it's so pretty it's got a little mushroom there and a flower I really like that and I believe that is it for my Dollarama and my Dollar Tree haul I hope that you have stayed to the end and I hope you like this video give me a thumbs up and uh, yeah we'll be seeing you soon 
I hope you guys are all staying healthy and safe. Um, yeah, I had to get out for a little bit because, you know, always staying home, always staying home. I had to just get out a little bit. So my husband's like, yep, you go uh, get what you need and get your little Dollar Rama and Dollar Tree fix. So <laughs> he's a sweetheart. Alrighty, take care. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. God bless.